Hey guys, Joshua Peterson with Peterson Electric here at a customer's house in Longmont. Uh, today's video for this week is going to be about batteries. Um, these are a 9 volt battery. When they dip below 8 volts, typically your smoke detectors will start to chirp. Um, smoke detectors are only good for 10 years. I think I've mentioned that before. Sometimes I've been able to get 12 to 14 out of them. Unless it's a really old school one, um, I've noticed those have lasted for a long time, like 40, 50, 60, 70 years old. Usually in those homes in the 70s, 60s, and 80s, they'll have one in the upstairs or in the main hallway, and that's it. Um, a lot of our um, cities are starting to request on permits to put in hardwire smoke detectors. Um, so anyways, that'll be another YouTube later for a permit process, but I wanted to talk to you about these batteries here that if you have, and you're a recycle person like my wife who forces me to recycle all my batteries, if they end up touching in a container like this, positive, negative, negative, positive, you're actually increasing that voltage by two. But what's gonna happen is you're shorting them out, positive and negative, positive and negative. If they get in a bag and you recycle and you leave them like this in the kitchen cabinet like everybody else or in the garage, these will melt down and you will start a fire because you're probably going to put them in a sandwich bag and then they're next to combustible material. There is a YouTube video about a guy, and I feel sorry for the guy and appreciate you doing your YouTube video, but he did burn down his whole home, he said, by keeping his batteries. This is not your typical AAA batteries or AA's. <clears throat> it is just your square 9-volt battery. If the terminals touch like this, you're going to be in trouble. So you need to take masking tape. Or I would use some electrical 3M tape. Uh, it's accessible at Home Depot and Lowe's, your big box stores. Black is typically fine and wrap them up. Now, if you are keeping your batteries and you're wrapping them, you can put on there the date that you bought them. It is a myth to stick them in the refrigerator. <laughs> I don't think that's gonna work. It's a myth to stick them in the freezer. You're actually gonna wear them out quicker. Um, they just need to stay at a room temperature. I never store my paint or my extra batteries outside in the garage where it gets cold and hot in Colorado. I keep them in my uh, storage area in my basement. Um, but when I do keep them, if they're out of their package, which hers are in a package, leave them in your package. Make sure that they see a date. If they're going to fall and there's two in there, then you're going to want to make sure you don't burn them up. Anyways, guys, thanks for joining us. Have a good day.